Hello and welcome to a brand new video by me, Nestor324. Hopefully you guys um, uh, will like this video and if you do, leave a like and if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. So today we're going to be seeing uh, my ideas that EA should implement it to pro clubs to make it a much better mode. So my first idea is uh, basically EA should add um, uh, a new concept to FIFA pro clubs because pro clubs has been the same since it was created if I'm not wrong. And uh, that's kind of boring guys, I think EA should add a new concept in which they add a bit of career mode and a bit of, uh, a bit of ultimate team. And basically how this is going to work is we open a starter pack and, uh, and that will grant us a full uh, uh, starting 11 and a full bench and a full reserve squad. And basically um, then we start playing our games and... Uh, as we evolve, the AI will evolve with us, and as we complete objectives, they, that will comp that will uh, grant us upgrade points. So let's say our AI, one of the AI is the man of the match. That will grant us an upgrade point that we can use to unlock training sessions, kind of like what we see in career mode. And these training sessions can be used um, exactly like they are used in career mode. We choose five players and. Uh, each player you can choose what dr what drill they're gonna do if it's passing dribbling and stuff and that will help um, uh, that will help uh, upgrading the player's stats the better you play the better the team plays and the better the team plays the faster your players will uh, get upgraded now if you're if you are relegated to to uh, from from a higher division to a lower division, your player stats will go down. If if the player is not uh, playing well, the stats will go down. So it kind of brings a little bit of realism into pro clubs. So I think EA should really add this to their game. It will make pro clubs much more fun and original because um, uh, it's pro clubs has been the same for a lot of years and a lot of people have stopped playing it because of that. Okay guys, the second thing I want to talk about is the ability to make substitutions. This is this should be in FIFA for a long time because this is something very important in case an AI isn't playing well or um, one of our friends disconnected or came a bit late. Anyways guys, I mean look at the bench in Pro Clubs. There's over 30 spots and the bench is, is, is too big to... Uh, and it's not being used, you know what I mean? So such a big bench and nobody, we can't make substitutions and I, I don't believe there's a club with, a, with, a, with that much players. And uh, I mean, come on, you only need 11 players at maximum to have a full team of, in pro clubs. And why would you need a bench with 30 plus spots and, and you basically won't use it at all? So I think EA should add a substitution uh, uh, substitution system. It's very simple. Come on, EA, you could do this. Um, uh, I mean, let's say a, uh, a AI got a yellow card, or the AI the AI is not playing well, or or something like that. You can easily we should be able to make an uh, a substitution. Come on, guys. That's come on, EA. That's very simple. That can make your game much better. Let's say one of our friends. Uh, came into the game a little bit early, a, a little bit late, or uh, or maybe he disconnected while joining the game. He should be able to go on the bench, and the captain of the team should be able to to sub him on. I mean, EA, this should be in the game already. Add it. And my last idea for uh, improvements on pro clubs is uh, the uh, kit and badge creator. Um. Since we are creating our own club, we should also be able to create our own kits and our own uh, um, uh, logos and, and even stadiums maybe, but stadiums is a bit too far, but we should be able to make our own kits and badges because that offers a lot more um, creativity. Um, uh, this footage you're seeing right now is from a YouTuber called Adam Pike or Peak or something like that. I'm gonna leave his uh, YouTube in the in the uh, description down below. Be sure to check him out. Uh, great graphics uh, YouTuber. And uh, going back to the video, um, we should be able to create our own club, our own uh, club kits, you know. And the same thing could be said about the badges. 
like kind of like what we see in Call of Duty Black Ops 3 we can be we should be able to make our own team badges and, and stuff um, of course there is a downside to this because um, a lot of uh, 12 year old kids or something like that will be will be making badges with penises on it and or saying offensive words or something of course they can be banned but they will keep doing that and I think that's one of the reasons EA still haven't implemented this into their game anyways guys i hope you liked my ideas leave your ideas in the comments down below don't forget to leave a like and of course don't forget to smash that subscribe button i'm out yeah because i got it like that flow so smooth like i got it on tap yeah and i'ma say it be a good night while i'm on my yingling while i'm drinking bud light uh can you get it when you miss me like i'm with whiskey drinking jim beam yeah baby do you do it do it that way do you do that do you take a break